Almost there. Almost there. No, we're not. No, we're not. No, we're not. Watch your fingers. Watch your fingers. Yeah. I've got my fingers. <laughs> you okay? No. We hurt. Great. Caesar's ghost. Look at this place. <laughs> So Penny's a little messy. A little messy? The Mandelbrot set of complex numbers is a little messy. This is chaos. Excuse me. Explain to me an organizational system where a tray of flatware on a couch is valid. <laughs> and I'm just inferring that this is a couch because the evidence suggests the coffee table's having a tiny garage sale. Did it ever occur to you that not everyone has the compulsive need to sort, organize, and label the entire world around them? No. <laughs> Well, they don't. Hard as it may be for you to believe, most people don't sort their breakfast cereal numerically by fiber content. Excuse me, but I think we've both found that helpful at times. <laughs> Come on, we should go. Hang on. What are you doing? I'm straightening up. Sheldon, this is not your home. No, this is not anyone's home. This is a swirling vortex of entropy. <laughs> When the transvestite lived here, you didn't care how he kept the place. Because it was immaculate. I mean, you open that man's closet, it was left to right evening gowns, cocktail dresses, and his police uniforms. What were you doing in his closet? I helped him run some cable for a webcam. Hey, guys. Oh, hey, Penny, this just arrived. We just brought this up. Just now. Great. Was it hard getting up the stairs? No. No? No. No. <laughs> We'll, we'll get out of your hair. Okay, great. Thank you again. Penny, <clears throat> I just want you to know that you don't have to live like this. I'm here for you. What's he talking about? It's a joke. I don't get it. Yeah, he didn't tell it right. <laughs> Sheldon? <laughs> Sheldon? Hello? sleep knowing that just outside my bedroom was our living room and just outside our living room was that hallway and immediately adjacent to that hallway was this. <laughs> Do you realize that if Penny wakes up, there is no reasonable explanation as to why we're here? I just gave you a reasonable explanation. <laughs> no, no, you gave me an explanation. Its reasonableness will be determined by a jury of your peers. <laughs> Don't be ridiculous. I have no peers. <laughs> then we have to get out of here. You might want to speak in a lower register. What? Evolution has made women sensitive to high-pitched noises while they sleep so that they'll be roused by a crying baby. If you want to avoid waking her, speak in a lower register. <laughs> That's ridiculous. No? <clears throat> That's ridiculous. <laughs> Fine. <laughs> I accept your premise, now please, let's go. I'm not leaving until I'm done. <laughs> if you have time to lean, you have time to clean. Oh, what the hell? <laughs>